This is Die Sporting Network. What, what, what. Back in the Die Sporting Network. Summertime Grand League quarterfinals. First game. St. Francis in the green. And the duck there to start by Montague. Up against Woodlawn. Woodlawn at the eighth seed. Got hill to climb in this one. Just got five guys on court here. So this one. St. Francis went six and one in summertime grind league season play. That three hits. And Woodlawn up by one. Woodlawn on a record of one and six. The one goes against Gilman. And Leon, the winner of this game will take on the final game. They're on Wednesday versus Cal against Newtown. Four five matchup. That's stolen away. James brings it back. One more time. That's a three. That one tipped and missed, batted away. And Woodlawn gets it back. St. Francis only lost to Calvin Hall. We did that game last week. Boy, definitely was going through. Man, this dude was going through the motion. Turnover. And side gets it home. Four three game. There for the Panthers. City Gilman, Mervo and Calvin Hall. Stacks in the middle. My finals are final. No Wednesday night. Swings it. Shot clock at six. Five, four, three, two, one. We'll knock it off in time. Ball back to the Panthers. Thirteen forty-six in the first round. St. Francis four zero in the DMV live period down at the Mantle. We know uh, comeback overtime win against Call Six. And hopefully that's a rematch we'll see in the regular season. The John City Challenge for the third year. Okay. Challenge. Diving. Three, got it! And the outside game up in Woodlawn so far, two threes. It's giving the Warriors a two point lead. Pull up jump. You got it. We're tied at six. <laughs> It's a drive. No run. And back the other way. Oh, got it all the way to the basket and in. Panthers up two. Stolen. Fast break. Nice recovery by Woodlawn to get it back. And the winner of this one be facing the winner of Gerstow. Newtown, timeout by Woodmark. So, the Warriors down by two here early. Use the long ball to get their two field goals so far as Woodmark. St. Francis has used the inside game to get there for them. Again, thank you for joining us here on the Dice Running Network. As always, check us out on the Twitter. Guys for Net, also on Instagram. On to your Boston League Weekly clips. Plays and of course our Facebook page, the High Sporting Net, and of course on the Mothership right here. High Sporting Network. Over 600 and 80 subscribers strong. That one shoots out of bounds. And the ball go back to Woodlawn. Oh, <laughs> 
Swing, three, that one goes in. And a lead back to one for one on. All their field goals have been from the outside. Uh, lost out of bounds, another turnover. Double team. Our summer league's going on at ECA. Going into August over at Parkville. So we Jack Reno. Inside. That one didn't go. The round of James. He brings it up now. Foul is called on the floor. Yes, well. Capital Hoops Summer League, the Matthew, the playoffs will be starting up next week. So three, no good. Tried to save it for no avail. What long gets it back? By one here. That's a drive inside and layup goes. We're going right now up 11 to 8. Time out by the Panthers. Kind of seen this story play out last Monday. Of course, we know we don't want to see it again. Watch me about that next. Next time TSE on DSN will be lots of league action coming your way. Next day Thursday and then on the 4th of July. Lots of league all-star game with them in the pits going at each other. Now St. Frank's is trying to get it going. Did here on the dive game network. And that St. Francis dominated by 21. Inside of it, oh, couldn't finish it. He gets it back. He does on the second goal. Line. Again. Funny how first two matches here tonight. Yes, City Gilman. This one here. Ball still on the deck. Maybe the safe. Roll it back. Three ball. No good. Offensive rebound. Once if you blocked it from behind. Frank is trying to get it going offensively. Let's see if the three does it. That's front end miss. To three, tip on this. The drive inside, got it in there. As they say, 13 to 10 game. Side is bounce, offensive rebound, no good. Third chance, didn't go, still. Ought to keep one the battle there defensively. Right at the halfway mark of the first half. Well, that was real close. For the tie. They missed it high. Bat it back to St. Francis. No fresh shot clock. Swings it. And shooting two. 
Mervo and Sink and Calvin Hall later on here. Rematch. Regular season match that we did here on the Dinosaur Network. IBBO 20-day challenge. Calvin Hall defeated Mervo there. Second shot. <laughs> Violation against the shooter. Shot will not count. So it's a two point lead. Oh, wow. He's on the line. And the ball goes back to St. Francis to get a gift. Swings for the lead. No good. Offensive rebound. Good to go. Ball on the deck. Woodlong gets it. Numbers in. Favor. He took it coast to coast. No good. Woodlong had two guys on that side. To the right. We should have passed it up. That was an open shot. He drive this time. And Sine puts it in there. Dead even at 13. Outlet pass. Blocked! From behind and out of bounds. That's a three. Tip to miss. Lots of people after. Side shot. Not hitting now for the Warriors. For three. Took it away. Still in at 13 here. Move. Scored most of the first half done. In this first quarterfinal game there. Right, Brian Lee also got a close to St. Paul League. Colleen Delaney and George Latin in that. And got down around the county. Long Reach, Broad Neck and Company. Nice summer. High school action going on in the area. Home to the Summertown Grind League here on the dice right now. That's the drive. Shot clock at one. Shot clock violation. James looking to come back in. Again. Dead even at 13. <laughs> Swings it. Inside and a foul. James pulls up, hits it. I pull up right there and 15 13 lead for St. Francis. France's first lead since they really dumped by Montague. Made it a 2 nothing effort. Swings it back over. And that's a three. No good. Under the leg. Nice save. Kick back. Floater. Mixed it high. Offensive rebound. Third chance. No good. James got it. Four minutes left in the half. Back up, back up, back up. Inside. Right, the off. Defensive rebound couldn't get it in. Anyone on it. Back now, they drop. Trying to tie with a two. And he trapped. Don't 
double. Swing. Drive. Blocked it. And we're going to get the back. Two point game still. Oh boy. Swing. There's a hot one in the turnover by the Warriors. Three spin down. That's a three from the outside. Tipped and miss. Saying not the doctor ordered right now for St. Francis again. And you know, a lot of their folks not here. You know, this team is talented. And get a lot of these young guys ready. And when the big season comes in the fall. That's a drive. That one's been out. Still trying to keep that top. Inside, body. Went down, no contact, and 17-13 is the score now, four point lead. That's out of bounds, Woodlawn keeps it. Oh no, said did not. One, said went out. One of the Warriors, Francis get it back, one for the four, not for For three, except the miss. James stole it, pulls up, and hits it. Game here. Oh, yeah. oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Stay in this game, definitely. It's to make it ugly. Hit the outside shot that they was doing early. Ooh, cut. Oh, but not jumper. No good. James, the tallest guy in there right now. He's taking advantage of it. Stolen away. Popped out of bounds. Ball was firing and quick. And ball stays with the Warriors. 43.8 point left there in the half. Desperation pass. Shot clock at 10. Jumper. Tipped and missed. Offensive rebound. Swings it back. Shot clock is off. Inside off the glass. Interference. They call a basket. Defensive interference. 11. For three. Got it. We fuck it there for St. Francis. Let's three to half, they made. Two. One. Travel comes and goes. Almost went in. So what ball is hung in this game? They've had the lead for most of the half, but they lost it late. And they're down 22 to 15 to the top seed of St. Francis Panthers. And the second half of this one is coming at you. Another nice way that was taking place. Second half of this one just started with Lawn. Down by seven. Here we get the top seed of St. Francis. Panthers pull out. Travel. And the Panthers get it back. Got on a little run before the half and was able to take the lead and keep it. That's the biggest margin they've had. The long distance shot still not falling consistently for Panthers. Hit one. Uh, what long hit it? Three of them. So gave my early lead. Pull up. No good. Offensive foul. 
Nice defense there. It's a walk as well. James swings it over. Another chance here. Shot clock at 20. It's a three. And James lays it in. Around the bend. Got it in. That still keeps it. Seven point advantage. Fakes, swings. James inside, blocking foul. Two shots coming up. City in Gilman, Melville County, Hart, and County Town to follow here. And the city, city is a two seed. Melville for three, Ghost Town's a four seed. New Town five, Calvin Hall six. Gilman's a seven seed, and the finally is what line you see now. That one goes in. Panthers up nine. Five balls loose. That's going the other way. Layup goes in. This one starting to go the way. Similar to the first matchup, did a little bit. This one's gotten the double figures now. Yeah, for St. Francis in the lead. For three. Check the miss. Nice grab of the rebound there. Got it in. Play there by number one Woodlawn. That cuts the lead tonight. James pulls up, fade away. And it didn't go. Swings, swings again for three. That one chipped and missed. Again, the outside shot not hitting for Woodlawn here in the second half. Drive this inside, got it in. Talk about a nice play. And that play there, you're moving Woodlawn in this one. They're down seven. Montague, off the glass and in. How about that one? Ball stays with uh, Woodlawn. Second time that Woodlawn has stepped on the line. It's the amount of ball. Montague. Got it again. Two nice buckets there by Montague. And at least to 11. 32 to 21. Almost turned over. Almost turned over. For three. That one tipped and missed bad it. That box should have reached out. And a foul. 
Jones looking to be a huge factor. Panthers this fall. Pull up. Missed it high. Over there. Place the D. Montague Britton and And out of bounds. Kick ball, kick ball. Golan keeps it. It's a drive. The tap goes in. Golan still hanging in this one. Hanging. Can they do? Gotta get a couple stops on the offensive end. That's a fake. Inside the Montague, that's two points, you know it. Crossover. The lane opens up. Two shots coming. So shot in. Shot in both. 425. That's a three. Hits it. That's a three. No good. That's a two. Swings it back out. James. He stepped out. Trying to say the ball, he stepped out. The ball back to uh, Woodlawn. Halfway done here in the second half. An eight point lead for St. Francis. Second half here, St. Francis in control. Face of the game. Makes it, drive, bat it away. I'm off you got it back. Try to throw it up there, but the shot clock went off and no good. There goes it. It's a three, no good. Ball point lead here for the Panthers. Off out of bounds. St. Francis gets it back. Pretty size roster. It's a three. Tip and miss. Float up. 
off the glass, miss. And steal back. Step back. Miss it high. Foul against Willard. That's a three. Spin it. Pull up. This is wide. Nice way to get it back. Blocked again by Montague. Numbers for the Panthers. And a layup. Substitution in. Time out by the Warriors as score is starting to fade on them. They're down 14, 39 15. And this one again coming up. Mervo, Calvin Hall later tonight. City and Gilman, another rematch for us here on the Dodge Network. Here in these quarterfinals. Two seed against a seven. That's coming up here. Now the hall, you gotta give them credit. They got hot late. Move themselves up the standings. Up to the six line. Including that big win last week they had against St. Francis right here on this court. Pull up. Offensive rebound, Montague. Just get high. Dishes, layup goes. Anderson beat St. Francis last in the final. Winning the first Grand League Championship. No good, ball back to Woodlock. It's a dry. Back over. Big fella. I don't tip the mess. Pass it back. Says the dagger. Good night. Oh, shooting and one with it. Do a long credit, they're still fighting. And this one, that, that man jumper, they might have did it. The Panthers on to the semifinals. Number one is their first shot, went in. Yeah, and one, excuse me, one in. All point game. It's a drive. Pull up. Tip the mess. Get the offense rebound and does. Resets the shot clock. It's a drive. That one didn't go to tap. Does go in by Montague. Pull up. Got it. Tough shot. Well, I'm definitely going to show they fought in this game. They definitely did. No question about that. In a region.
There's 28 left in this one. Got it in there. Montague again. Reversal goes. Lays it in. Put a little cherry on tight. Side. That's a lot. I would break that one. Six, six. Six, six. Six, six. Six, six. So three, nailed it. Outside shot was not hitting in the second half. That's the first three, I believe. By Willow. 29 left. Another point game. Montague. Missed it. And pass back goes. Well, I always score more than their first matchup against St. Frank's. And a foul. Stolen away. Back over. That was a high reversal. Got it back. Got it back. Got it in. We still 11. Said one on his part. Just a little out, man. In this one. Foul. Timeout by uh, St. Francis. 50 39. St. Francis will be awaiting the winner of Newtown, Walgers Town. That layup did not go. Slams it down in the middle. That will put the wrap on it. St. Francis moving on to the Summertime Grand League semifinal. Matt will do it. Thirty points in the second half for the Panthers. They went fifty-two to thirty-nine. Yeah. We we'll say so long to you for now. Our second quarterfinal matchup with City and Gilman. That's coming up here on the Rise Ring Network. Two seed against the seven. Coming up. This is Die Sporting Network. What, what, what?